So you are a PC gamer and you got Xbox One or more recently Series S and X controllers that you connect via this Microsoft wireless adapter that they sell. If you remember when you actually bought them, the only way to pair a controller to the adapter is by pressing and holding the button on both the devices and they'll blink rapidly and pair with each other. Now in my experience from time to time these controllers will lose pairing or will require a restart of your system but because that adapter is tucked away behind your desktop or monitor or really any inaccessible and inconvenient spot. So how do you pair it without going through all the fuss of pressing buttons and finding the device? It's very simple. Just open the start menu, type in devices, select Bluetooth and other devices. Now here's the secret part. You would think that you would have to press the pairing button at least on the controller, right? But you're talking about Microsoft here. So here's what you need to do. Click on add device, then click on everything else which supports Xbox controllers with wireless adapter. And now all you need to do is just turn on the controller in normal mode by pressing the Xbox button. Do not press the pairing button, it will not work with this method. Look for the slow blink on your controller and almost as soon as you see it, you will see the Xbox One wireless controller show up on your PC. It's simple as clicking on it and done, you paired your controller to your PC. Now you've saved yourself some hassle and time. Now enjoy the new God of War game recently released on PC with your Xbox controller. Also, let me know down in the comments below, which is your favorite game to play with the controller? Mine is Rocket League and For Honor as well as any story game. Anyway guys, smash that like button if this video was helpful. Consider subscribing and dinging that notification bell if you want to watch more content like this. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Cheers.